What's up everybody? <laughs> Dylan here from Iceberg TV. We are here with Grant Latin today. We're doing another we're doing another use disc challenge. We're pretty excited. I'll show you guys what I got real quick. Grant will show you what he got. Got a DL Steady I'll be putting with. I got a Luna. I've got the Gateway Team Stamped Element. I've got the Spark. I've got a, a Goldline Explorer, a Raptor, a Metal Flake Roadrunner, and a really sick limited edition Fusion Trespass. I got all these over at Down for Disc Golf. That's my favorite place in Charlotte to get used discs. If you've never been over there, go get used discs over there. What'd you get? All right, boom. So we got a Lucid Air Trespass right here. Got a Rye, a couple nice drivers. Got a Raider here. Should be beat in, it's pretty flippy. Got a Fusion Felon, a little bit of a straighter nine speed. Got the Crave, have an ESP Buzz, and got a little Judge, a little Putt and Putter, and a Glow Envy right here. So we should be good to go. Let's go ahead and get to it. We're playing Best Shot Doubles. We've never thrown any of these discs before. Hole one, going with the Z Raptor. This is, I think, newer old, but it's a pretty sweet Z line Raptor. We'll go with the Flex line here on hole one. Oh, it's a flippy raptor. Skip. Oh, that's nice. Hey. There we go. Good shot. All right, let's do it. So I really want to know, do you guys bag any used discs? If so, let me know what mold you're bagging. And if you don't, let me know why not. I really want to know what you guys are bagging. Let's go knock down this birdie putt. Unbelievable shot, dude. Oh no. You're gonna have to tap it out. Oh no. You're gonna have to tap it out. Let me get my steady out. Oh. Gotta use the putt and putter, ladies and gentlemen. Is that what the putting's gonna be like today? I don't know what happened there. Thank goodness. Great drive, I'll, I'll save you with the good putt. All right, hole two, we got a 282 foot par three. It is pretty uphill. We're gonna give this metal flake Roadrunner a go. I don't know if this is gonna be flippy or stable, but you don't see metal flake Roadrunners very often. flip to it a little more than I expected but that's gonna be a circle's edge putt let's go Sarah Hulk and Crave right here nice all right let's see what we got oh dude Grant is saving us off the tee right now as long as it has the distance oh man I like it we got a long putt oh not bad oh all okay. right it's not a bad bid, on it. That was right there. This DL Steady, really stiff beaded putter. <laughs> I can't blame the wind today. That flag's not moving at all. Oh, come on. Ah! Oh. That would've been a nice one to get. Great drive. Sorry, I failed you on the putt. Oh. Let's go. Grant recently hit 1,000 subscribers on YouTube, but yeah. let's help him get to 2,000. Go subscribe to his channel. Let's do it. So we came up a little bit short. If I got maybe 30 to 40 more feet and then came here, we'd be inside the circle, but we got what we got. The steady DL, I think I can make at least one or two of these today. Come on. Oh, oh hit the cage. Oh man. That was a nice little run right that there. That DL is great. Oh boy. Here we go. We got the glow envy here. All right, come on, Grant. Oh. Give it a shot. Swing. Right. Oh, good height. Good height. All right. Unfortunately, we're taking a par here. This course features some really difficult par threes. The par fours are a lot more scorable, but the par threes tend to be tough out here. Hole four is an absolute monster of a par three. It's 370 feet, OB, all in that long grass to the right of the basket. We're gonna go back to the Fusion Trespass here. I need to get this to turn here, fading away from the OB. Oh, that had the perfect turn on it. Grant's gonna need to save us here. Right. What are you gonna go with, you think? Uh, I'm thinking the Crave. Yeah, good safe Once play. Again, yeah. The Cured it, come on. Oh no. 
my gosh. All right, guys, Grant's drive is barely short of this uh, OB here. So we should be able to get up and down for the easy par. I'm gonna go with the spark on this shot, I think. The spark, hopefully it's more stable than that fake Raptor. The fake Raptor went a little bit too straight for me. So hopefully this thing's got a little bit of fade on it. Throws it in. Oh, it's beef. Wow. Hopefully it's in bounds. That OB is tight to the pin. He doesn't have the touch yet. Oh. Take our meter, we're basically already in the bucket. That's gonna be a good par. A lot more birdies on the back nine. The front nine here is tough. Oh, dude. Oh, dude, that might do it. Get up there. Come on. Dude, that was awesome. Oh, oh. you caught those last trees on the right. That was oh, insanely man. good. Nice pull. <laughs> Let's go. All right, this is, the, this, this is the lowest parting line Raider I've ever seen. So hopefully I can get it to turn just like he got my trust. He threw my trespass there. That was pretty cool. We're nice and close. I almost drained that putt. That's going to be a nice par. One under par through five holes here is actually a really hot start, yeah, believe it or hot. not. Oh, get up there. That's actually going to play. Okay, okay, it kept going. That's like par at worst. I'm going to try this Lucid Air Trespass. I think the Lucid Air Trespass is actually more stable than that Raider, which I know makes no sense, but it's just, just the way that it is. 158 gram. See how this thing, oh, 150, yeah, 158 gram. Let's see how she bore hands. Dude, Let's I did go. it. Come oh on, get off gosh. it. No. no. That had such high hopes. That was such a crispy shot. No way. Oh. Man, this shot had such high hopes. I barely clipped this last cabbage right at the end. Um, we're gonna go back to the spark here. Just have to swing it around this corner. Just need a hard left to right moving hyzer. That should be absolutely parked. No, most righties are not doing that. All right, Grant's lefty shot is better than my righty shot. I told you guys, the kid's good. Knock it down. Nice Let's shot. Go. Come on, dog. Hot dog. Thanks for bailing me out. I'm loving it. Let's go. Come on. Oh, it's a nice looking bid. Oh, All right. Man. It was kind of excusable to miss some of those last holes because they're so hard, but we really need to start getting birdies soon here. Oh yeah. Come on, got it. Yes. Let's go. Big dog. Uh, Come uh. on. <laughs> Big dog. Big dog. Hole eight, we got a 533 foot par four. I'm gonna go back to this beefy Lucid Air Trespass. I think if I can hit it on that high ante, I think I can get this thing to carry actually some impressive distance. That's not enough height. Darn. Oh man, okay. I need you to bail us out. We got it. That didn't flex out as hard as I yeah. thought it was going to. Yep, flip. All right. That's way up there, dude. Oh yeah. We should have a nice spark up and down. That'll work. And if you guys are, you know, wanting to see the back nine, you're gonna have to go over to Grant's channel, which I'll link in the description below to see the back nine. Currently, I believe we're two under par, hopefully eyeing up another birdie here. The next hole's another long par four, hopefully be able to finish out with two birdies here, have a lot of momentum heading into Grant's channel. 
Again, I need to know, do you guys bag used discs? Comment down below. Let's finish out these two holes and we'll see you on Grant's channel. This isn't a tester. This is gonna be the last hole of today's video. It's a 630 foot par four. Gonna go back to the Aquaman Trespass Fusion. Let's give this thing some height, unlike the last tee shot. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Big. Oh That's my big. gosh. Oh, we're getting another birdie. <laughs> that was massive. <laughs> that was massive. Had a plenty Let's of go. height. Plenty of height. Yup. That's smacked as well. Wow. Come out. Dude, that's sick. Oh, wow. I, try the reader. I like it. All right, comment below which one went farther. I was killing or Grants. Here we go. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I cracked the code on this gateway disc. Daryl told me it was an element, but it's actually a spruce, which is a very beefy mid range. I think my trespass went a little bit farther, so I'm the distance king temporarily, but let's see if we can get the spruce in there for another look now that I actually know what this disc is. Dude. That was right there. Run it. Get up there. Oh no. This is for us to go four down. I honestly missed the eagle by just a foot or two too high. Shout out to the spruce. This disc is fire. I'm pumped now that I realized it was a spruce. Anyway, go to Grant's channel. Check out the back nine. Shout out Down for Disc Golf for letting us use all of the used discs for today. And then shout out the other video sponsor, BergsDiscSports.com. Use my discount code, ICE20, and you get 20% off the best disc golf bag ever made. Anyway, we'll see you guys in the next video. See you on Grant's channel and take care.